Hey folks, welcome back. We're back on the uh, on the Eastern Front, pushing forward once again into <coughs> excuse me into um, Poland. As you can see, we did not get our 222 back again, but that's fine. We'll go ahead and we'll fluff up the rest of these guys. We don't have all that many points, um, but you know we didn't. We're not spendthrift. Whoops, we're not spendthrifty, so uh, we should be able to get something. There you go, 69 points. All right, let's take a look at a map here. So we've got a bridge crossing. Um, this is going to be, uh, this is going to be interesting. All right. Yeah, we're going to need another tank. Armor. Ah, motorcycles. An SS motorcycle. Ah. <laughs> Look at that. A Kubelwagen. I actually own one of these. Um, it's a Model 181. No, like in real life. I've got some, uh, Photos of it on my uh, Facebook page. My Facebook page is uh, Nikki Reborn, R-E-B-O-R-N. But uh, anyways, that's 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 what it is. Okay, so um, okay, that's a twenty millimeter. That that might be worth something for us. That's going to be a step up from the two twenty two. Let's take that. Okay. Let's see what we can get for this, guys. There you go, 231. Okay, we can finally get this darn, or two, uh, 223. All right, I'm going to stand by. i got to sneeze. i got allergies. Sorry about that. It's spring and the front window's open. Okay, so we'll get one of these. There we are. Okay, that's just a machine gun. Nothing special. Okay, so we've got uh, uh, Panzerkampfwagen 3A. It should have a 37. 37 millimeter. Yep, 37 millimeter. Then we got this guy. He should have a 37 millimeter. Yep. And then we got this guy. He's got our auto. And then here's a 37 uh, auto cannon. <laughs> Fantastic. Fantastic, guys. Let's see if we can get a refit on this because we got no. We got one guy wounded. You see the little head here? Oh, man. One of our commander guys are wounded also. All right. Well, off we go. We get, don't have enough points for another slot, but that's okay. We're... Oh, wait a minute. Let's see if we can... Uh, no. Damn. Let's see if we're getting any heavier uh, support. Nope, that's it. Flamethrower, that's no use. Not in the open. Maybe in the city. But uh, I'm not... Unless, unless we're fighting in a fight in, all the way into uh, uh, Warsaw, that's not going to be of much use. I do like half-tracks, though. We might get some of those later on here. All right, let's go. I would have gotten one if we'd had enough points. They're good for support. Unfortunately, this one you can't mount and dismount like you can in um, uh, modern combat. All right, guys, here we are. So we're going to have to set up to cross this river here. So what we're going to do is... Oh, look at that. That's actually not a bad idea. What we're going to do is we're going to have all of our guys line up and let's move it that way. Okay, here we go. Let's see if we can see over. Yeah, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to push over with our infantry. And then after our infantry is over, we're going to uh, bum rush with our, with our tanks. And the reason we're going to do that is because if a tank gets knocked out on this bridge, then um, we're going to have a very hard way of getting back. Other, other vehicles over here. So we don't want to lose a tank on top of the bridge. So to help avoid that, we are going to just basically charge across the bridge, to be quite honest with you. So we're going to take up positions, make sure there's nothing in here, make sure there's nothing over here, and then we're going to run our, our tanks over real fast. So we're going to establish a... Uh, a foothold over here. We 
Run, 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 run. Let me check and make sure all these things are set correctly. Excuse me. I'm sorry for all my sniffling, guys. Fast, slow. Okay, good. Now, our uh, AA gun is not going to be of much use unless there's something out in this field. Because the, the time that it takes to get them to move is just, it's, it's excessive. I guess I can defend with him, too. <clears throat> okay. Discretion is a better part of Alan. This you, you have to learn to be, to use strategy and planning and such. You can't just go, like, thumb crazy. You, you have to have reason for everything that you do in this game. This is... This is very much a, a really, really, really good tactical slash strategy game because it really teaches you to have patience and not just go crazy on stuff. Mm. Try my cigarette. Okay. One unit's in place. All right, so we're going to start uh, moving and clearing these uh, woods. I'm not sure if that's got enough to for 100% for all this, but it's we're we're, we're definitely going to put a big swad through there of that's free of enemies. <clears throat> all right. Now, there's some decision as to whether we should move that guy or not, but it's a it's just a 50 millimeter. If it was a 120 or like an 82 millimeter or something like that, I probably would have kept it back and waited. But uh, not for not for a 50 millimeter because it, that, at at this range it would be very difficult to hit anything, and if you did, it's not very effective. I wouldn't mind a couple 50 millimeter mortars for a 28 millimeter figures. All right, there we got another one. Go up to the front. That's not really much coverage, is it? Excuse me. Sorry for all my sniffling, guys. I don't mean anything, but what the heck? Oh man. Let's move these guys up here. Kind of like on this little precipice here so we can get and look over, I guess, our future advances. And then we're going to come down here and take this. And then we're going to work our way up north. Look at that church. It's pretty cool. It's big spires. Level 5, wow. So if they wanted to be dropping artillery down on us, they could right now. So, in, in retrospect, after our last little battle we had... We saw the Poles fought very bravely. In other words, if you get hits on them, they don't, like, automatically give up and, like, go to ground and look for cover and all that kind of stuff. They, they pretty much stick where they are. Uh, but the problem is, is they're very brittle. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to try to just basically kick in the front door. It's basically what we're going to try to do here. We're going to try to kick in the front door. And they shatter it. Just completely shatter their defenses. All right, here we go. We're going to do these in order of strength of their armor. Because theoretically, if we put a small one first, you get knocked out like our 223. So we're going to do it in reverse order of the armor. Or I guess armor from the thickest to the lowest. That way it's just it's one one less little thing. You know, this is... This is a game of margins, you know, every little piece here, every little sliver there. So we're going to keep, just keep pushing things up. It's our mortar crew here. <laughs> Excuse me. We're going to put these guys up here to go on Overwatch to make sure we don't have any, um, like, vehicles or anything that try to make their way, you know, to support this as we as we go to go take it out. We haven't seen any um, 
Polish tanks yet, which I kind of like to see just because they're kind of cool. They're kind of neat. They go with uh, more of the tank get theory. They have a few smaller tanks, um, but a lot of theirs are very, very small. They'll only carry like an anti-tank rifle or machine gun. They did have some armored cars, but uh, those were not... Uh, they just didn't have a whole heck of a lot of them. Okay, we're going to put this down to just move now. All right, we got somebody over here. There's somebody over here in this area. And it's important that we flush them out. Uh-oh, here comes, here comes Artie. Their mortars. It's going to be their mortars. And then we're starting to sneak our vehicles across. We're going to set up on this uh, ridge here. <laughs> there we go. Sweetness. All right, we, get, we know where they are now. All right, they're going to be right over here. Let's wait for them to do something stupid again. As soon as we've got the line of sight on them, we're going to charge them. That's good enough for us to go ahead and make our commitment, as far as I'm concerned. See, look at these guys. See? They're taking cover. See, look. Do you see that? The yellow one right here, number 12? That's them. That's what I was talking about, about that that the, the Poles have a, a much higher Elan rating. But to be quite honest with you, um, in, in my little humble opinion, um, they're a little bit too fragile. More armored cars go zooming across the bridge. There's our AA gun. It's going to take them six years and a moon to get over there. All right, those guys are going and setting up their position. All right. Those guys have their position set up. We're going to keep coming down so we can provide overwatch there. Excuse me. I'm going to take this tank and put it somewhere good, a good bit back here. There we go. And we're going to get them with their machine gun now, too. Okay, that's good. And there's another one over here, too. Good. Okay, we apparently have discovered where they've been hiding. Get up there, guys. I'm not willing to let you guys just sit back and dilly-dally. That's a full-size squad right there. All right, here go the poles are talking. I don't know what that means. There we go. We're going to put an end to them. Yeah. What the heck? What is this guy doing? What the heck is that guy doing? He's like a battle berserker or something. Dude, you need to shoot at them. Looks like they're calling in artillery on us now. Damn it! He took us out! Son of a bitch! I knew it! I knew it was going to happen just like a scout! Damn it! Son of a bitch. Well, there you go. That's exactly why you try to keep your... That's why infantry is dangerous. Bang, off the goes, blew up. It probably blew the crew, too. Damn. <coughs> Excuse 
Excuse me. Oh, we're just going to keep plugging away at these guys. We got him. We got him. All right. All right. They've got some... Uh... Okay, looks like our spotting worked. There you go. That looks like a machine gun group. Uh, guys, if you want to live... Oh, there we go. There we go. There's some more guys here. Let me get that armored car up on the line. He's taking his own... He's having some uh, pathfinding issues. Let's hope we don't immobilize our little armored car here by going through the woods or going over that fence. I take nothing for granted. All right. Yeah, I think they're getting ready to break. So I'm going to take these... Because our crew. That's too bad we lost our Mark III. Oh, well. It is what it is. All right. Let's get down in here. These guys are just, like, hunkering down. Man. All right. Let's get this vehicle over here to this ridge. Get this guy. I'm going to just move him up over here so we can get some good hot and heavy uh, stuff. Let's see if these guys can take these guys out. They can. Yeah, we'll, take, we'll shoot at them. I don't know if that was rifle grenades or something. Yep, they're getting ready to break. They're getting ready to break. Yep, yeah, they broke. That's it. Yeah, they shattered. So, very good. At, hey, at least we know that our, our plan of how we're going to engage is, is, is functioning well. So that's too bad we lost that tank. That turned a really good victory into kind of something crappy. Look at that, got 10 guys. Oh, no, I got five guys there. I'm sorry. I forgot this one's got total. But uh, anyways, that's going to do it for this time. So next time we're going to continue on and just keep delving down deeper into the into Polish territory. We've got them back on the, on the ropes. We're not getting as many kills, total kills, as I would like to. Um... But uh, because it, just because they're breaking too quick and, and fleeing. But unfortunately, that means that they're going to be able to keep their um, vehicles and such. And we need to just take them out. We need to take them out or we'll have trouble down the road. Anyways, guys, that's going to do it for this day. Um, please do me a favor. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you think. This is Nikki signing out. See ya. Bye.